All right, welcome to fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada for the game of the week for week four of the DSFL. The Denver Crush coming to town to take on the red hot Las Vegas show. We swept these guys a season ago, three and one overall in the rivalry. The new Hall of Famer, Dick Vermeil against, I don't know, the potentially future Hall of Famer, Mike Shanahan, who knows. Vegas coming out in the Las Vegas Outlaws inspired alternate uniforms. Denver looking slick in the old school Broncos inspired jerseys. And Jake Delhomme over to Tyrone Calico. Short three and out go the crush on their opening possession. And Quan Bolden, big time play, gets him up near midfield from number 81 out of Florida State. Vic outside is picked off. By John Lynch, he's still going. Michael Vick going to chase him down, but the current 49ers general manager, who I love, takes it down inside the 10-yard line. Picked off! Sammy Davis is going the other way! Denver gives it right back to McAllister, right on his tail. We're going to the middle of the field. I think it makes us go faster. And when is he going to make the tackle? Not until Sammy Davis is inside the 15-yard line. Sammy Davis, the star once again in Vegas, has made the Pro Bowl each of the last two years. Jeremy Shockey, touchdown show. All right, slight delay with that interception to Lynch, but Vic looking slick in the alternate jerseys. Finds Jeremy Shockey, Niner fan there, tackling him in the end zone. The rookie at a Dave show. Not going to get the tackle that time. Deuce McAllister, a nice run there. Play action, Del Home. Pass falls incomplete. Sammy Davis again. And it's another Denver punt. Vic, wide open field to the outside. Going to cross the 50. And that is what we do best around here. If we didn't have that, I would have no chance. Wide open over the middle is the fullback. Rock Cartwright takes a big hit inside the 30-yard line. This play, second down and 10, and that is what every defense should be doing against me all the time. Third down and 20. Got wide open field to the right. Let's get back into field goal range. This is exactly what he does. 47-yard attempt from Sebastian Janikowski is good. And it's 10-0 show with 2.29 to go in the first quarter. Del Ohm over the middle, sliding catch from Dante Stallworth. Nice play there. Third down and two, look out! Ed Reed launches himself into the quarterback. I'm pretty sure that's not legal in 2022. And it's another Denver punt. Vic going to find Lance Moore on the curl route. Third down and two, play action. And when we pushed X, we wanted to sprint. But we didn't push L2 in time, and that is a bonehead play for me. Not a bonehead play there from Deuce McAllister. Nice spin move. Ends the first quarter, 10-0. Las Vegas show looking to keep this roll going. Get to 4-0, and McAllister, another nice spin move. Julian Peterson whiffing on the tackle, but it was only good for three. This time, McAllister able to get the first down, nine yards on that carry. Del Home just gets it off. Finds Deuce McAllister in the flat. And the crush finally got something going here on offense. Second down and 10. Over the middle. And Jeff Ulberg back to his old stealth. Can't make the catch. He had three picks last week. Third down and 10. That's batted away by Asante Samuel. A lot of contact, but no flag. I have not seen a pass interference call. Look at this S word. Bounces right back. And goes out of bounds at the five. Vic play action. And there is what every defense should be doing against me all the time. Fortunately, the computer is stupid. 10 to 2. And there is a sack. Hello, Newman. My favorite sack celebration. The push-ups. And another Denver crush punt. Rudy. Rudy takes a big hit, but not before. A gain of second, second down in three. Rock Cartwright, the fullback, another catch. And it's a first down for the Las Vegas show. Vic, wide open field stop. Pop find Anquan Bolden. 
And we're up near the 50, second down and four. Michael Vick surveying the field, and it's just short of Reggie Wayne. Third down and four. Play action, rolling out. There's Jeremy Shockey. I love this play when it works. And we're down inside the three yard line with 2.42 to go in the half. Just gets it off. And Quan Bolden over the middle down to the 12 yard line, 2.16 on the clock. Wide open field for Michael Vick. Touchdown show. Crowd all fired up. Break out the black face. And it is 17 to two, just shy of the two minute warning. In fact, it's gonna be right after this play. And now a minute 47, and Jeff Albrick, another pick, four interceptions for the Vegas linebacker in the last two weeks. And we got the ball sitting pretty here in Denver territory. That pass incomplete intended for Jeremy Shockey along the sideline. Second down and 10, throwing to L1 a little too late, Rudy Johnson, and it's another incomplete pass. Third and 10, Vic over the middle, nobody home, and it's three straight incomplete passes. Sebastian Janikowski from 55 yards out is good! Nailed it, 20 to two, with a buck 25 to go in the half. Delhomme finds Paris Warren on that one, second down and in inches. Floats this one out to Tyrone Calico. Missed tackle, another and a third. Calico going the distance. And we're not talking about my favorite hiking trail. Calico tanks, look it up. 67 yards by the Denver wide receiver and the offense finally getting something done. It's 20 to nine, but here is our best play on offense. Vic going over midfield. We got 52 seconds on the clock now, 45 seconds. Vic launching it and caught! Reggie Wayne inside the 15 yard line and our offense is unstoppable. Oh no! Ricochet picked off. Roy Williams makes the catch. And it's our second interception of the season. Oh, in the end zone, outside. That one batted out of the air by Sammy Davis. Second down and 10 floats this one out and Sammy Davis again on the coverage, having a hell of a game. Third down and 10, Delhomme plenty of time and getting a hand on it was, I couldn't see the number, 16 seconds. The way we're going, that's gonna die plenty of time. Rock Cartwright, the fullback having a hell of a game. We're inside the 35. Okay, we're getting a little too confident and okay. Careful there, six seconds on the clock. Janikowski from 52 yards out is good. Nailing the kicking meter in this one. Still two seconds to go in the half, showing off the special teams play. What are we gonna have here? Paris Warren on the kick return. Asante Samuel forces the fumble and picks it up and he's taking it into the end zone. Touchdown show. 17 yard fumble return. The Vegas crowd losing their minds as it's 30 to nine at halftime. Oh man, this is the year, fellas. Over the middle to Brandon Mullamanamana and he can't make the catch. Vegas opening possession of the second half. That's batted away. Third down and 10. Vic scrambling and we're a little indecisive here. Gonna go three and out on the opening possession of the second half, but it's 30 to nine. Finds Antonio Gates at midfield. Denver has a long way to go to get back into this one. Antonio Gates making the catch again. They're into Vegas territory. Third and inches, they throw it. And on fourth and inches, they punt it down 30 to nine. And it's picked off! Ben Taylor. Unbelievable interception. Crap. Look at this thing. Holy crap. Get this guy on offense. Your guys are struggling. Put 58 out there. And Denver gets the ball deep into Vegas territory. Delhomme gets this one out to Antonio Gates. Tumbles down out of bounds at the 13 yard line. This play first and goal. Deuce McAllister on the run. Denver, one of the top uh, running, rushing offenses in the league, but that's going to be stopped by one of the top rushing defenses in the league. Third and goal. McAllister, three straight runs. Can't get it in. They trot out Jay Feely for the short field goal, and it is good. 
Uh, running into the kicker, irrelevant, 30 to 12 with just under three minutes to go in the third quarter. Reggie Wayne, Niner fan, messing up on defense. And we're running it down inside the 25 yard line. Come on, rookie, get yourself into the game here. And the crowd going to worship Reggie Wayne on his effort. There we go, I haven't seen that one. And first and 10, Vegas in the 25 yard line. Play action pass to Rudy, 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 Rudy Johnson inside the 20 yard line. Play action again. And we're going Rudy, Rudy again inside the 15 yard line. Buck 41 to go in the third quarter. Curl route to Reggie Wayne and Niner fan not able to make the play, but does keep him out of the end zone. Play action and sacked. Godly, that keeps happening. And we're running into another sack. Just like the end of the LA game. Oh, and they're doing the push ups too. I love that celebration. Boy, those guys are in freaking shape. Third and goal, and Vic's just going to get it to be a chip shot field goal. Janikowski having a hell of a game. This time from 25 yards out is good. 33 to 12 is the score at the end of the third quarter. All Vegas in this one. And what action we have seen. Third down and three, and it's another three and out. Sammy Davis almost with his second interception of the game. Vic feeling the pass rush, and they're leaving the fullback wide open on this play. <laughs> Is this an exploit play? Maybe I should be doing it every single time. Third down and 12. Vic scrambling to the right and is going to get the field goal attempt a little bit closer. Janikowski, red hot Sebastian from 47 yards out. I am all over that kicking meter. My goodness, I've got it figured out today, baby. 36 to 12. Over the middle to Paris Warren. Gonna get Denver up to the 45 yard line with 417 to go in this one. Garbage time, fellas. Antonio Gates catches it at the Vegas 37 yard line. Delhomme throwing, going deep downfield. Caught! Oh, touchdown crush! Dante Stallworth and oops. I kind of messed up with the ref there. Two point conversion. Deuce McAllister is good. And the score 36 to 20. With just under four minutes to go, Denver going for the onside kick, and Reggie Wayne is going to have the recovery. Vegas taking over inside the Denver 40-yard line. This place second and 12. Clear out that side of the field and let number seven dive down inside the 25-yard line. Having a good time here. Rudy, Rudy, Rudy down inside the 15-yard line. And just coming out of the two-minute warning here, Denver was calling timeouts. And so Vic is going to take it into the end zone. Suck on that one, Crush. 43-20 to 20 is your score as the faithful, Vegas faithful, all fired up here in this one. Dante Stallworth with the catch. We're at a buck 26. This play fourth down and five. Play action. Stallworth over the middle. Denver into... Vegas territory able to handle the high snap. We've got Tyrone Calico taking a big hit at the 34 yard line. Less than a minute to go now. Uh, Jake Delhomme, now he's starting to deal. Antonio Gates with the catch there. It's third down and 10, and he finds Paris Warren. Gets run over by Jeff Ulbrich. Second down and 10, 24 23. Antonio Gates with the catch. Third down and three. Delhomme is picked off! Jeff Ulbrich! Five interceptions in two weeks for the Vegas linebacker. Guy drops him all the time, but we have to take over at the one. Rudy Johnson is tackled in the end zone. And Denver has two safeties in this one. 43 to 22. Sacked by John Thornton. And that's going to do it. 43-22. Hell of a score. And that's how this one is going to play out as the Las Vegas show. Jeff Ulbrich, another red hot game on defense. 4 0 on the season. Are we, are, are we watching the Super Bowl champions play today? Seven total turnovers. But Vic, with three interceptions, takes him to four on the season. I think the, each of the first two years, we we're well into the late 20s in interceptions. So we're still not on pace for that. Thank God for that. But we'll see what happens moving forward. Vic, 106 yards rushing, two rushing touchdowns. 
and on nine attempts. Rock Cartwright, the most effective receiver, four catches for 71 yards. Antonio Gates, nine catches, 81 yards for the Denver tight end. And let's put Jeff Olbert's smiling face there. Once again, five picks in two games. Marcus Tuiasasopo almost beats Peyton Manning. Still no Robert Taylor. San Diego, the world champs keeping pace with us. They're 4-0 after they beat the Ravagers. The Houston Meteors get their first win of the season over Cleveland. And now pray for them as they welcome in the 4-0 Number one in the league in turnover differential, Las Vegas Show. All right, guys, a lot of optimism over here. Let me know your thoughts on this game down in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next show.